Hello everybody, today I want to talk to you about the arabesque. Yes, we know. Yes, we know. And in particular about the open arabesque, how it differs from the bar and how we're starting to learn it. So, when we start learning in arabesque, we really want to be square before we can to change it and vary it. So we have a first arabesque, for example, and we have one arm right in front of the shoulder, even in line with the shoulder, and the other arm on the side, also in line with the shoulder. So we have a 90 degree angle, and the hips are square. So from Ipulmong, it looks like that. From Anfas, it looks like that. Now there's always the question about are we allowed to open the hip when we challenged with our turnout? Because when the hip sockets face forward, yet we have to move the leg behind in a turnout, it's quite impossible for many people. So in the first instance, I suggest you have the leg more on the side of you, but you keep the hips square at least at the bar work in the beginning. Now when we are in the center, we learned our square hips, our square shoulders, the 90 degree angle of our arms. We allowed them to open the hip, but how? We turn out the thigh bone and the hip will follow. So if we rotate the thigh bone out, the hip will open a little bit and that's what we mean by opening the hip, not the hip without the engagement of the leg. So it always depends on the intention we have. Rotate the thigh out, hip will open. Now, the next question is, do I get my arm behind me? No, the arm stays always in line with your shoulder. What happens? You bring the lowest rib, the floating rib, forward. That creates the twist. So this rib cage reaches forward and that opens the line. So it's not hip, arm, but it's thigh bone, rib cage. And this creates longer and more open lines that are much more attractive and much more projective to the audience. Square and open. And the same applies when the leg is off the floor. I hope that helps. Thank you. Let me know any question you may have. And also check out my holistic ballet DVDs. Bye for now.